Right, well, good morning. And this morning I'm looking at the Switch and I'm hoping against hope that Nintendo don't come and give me a copyright strike on this one because I'm showing their menus. I think it's probably just with their games, but who knows. So if this video disappears, you know why. Basically, what's happened this morning is that I've tried to go in and log into the eShop, basically. And when I go into the eShop, I'm getting this error problem. So if we go in, just wait for it to try and go in. And as you can see, it's taking its time. And eventually, we will get an error message. There you go. Connection test failed. Could not perform DNS name resolution. Please try again later. And if you go into details, it just gives you a few more details about the problem. And you get an error code 2110-3127. So I thought, oh, well, you know, it's not a problem. I'll just go in and I'll check my network settings. So I go into my internet and I look at my internet settings. And it comes up with the one I'm logged into at the moment. And that should be working fine because it's showing that I'm logged into it. But again, if I go back into my settings and I test the connection, I get the same error message again. And I was going around and around in circles and I couldn't work out what was going on because I'd disconnected from this and reconnected or tried to reconnect and I'm getting the same error message and I couldn't get on at all. So in the end, what I came up with through reading around and some people were suggesting this was that you basically need to do a hard reboot, if you like. You need to actually turn the switch completely off and back on again. And that should solve the problem. So I'm going to try that now. So if we go into power options, what you do is you hold the power button on the switch for 10 seconds and it comes up with this. So we want power options, power off. And obviously the recording is now going to stop. So we'll come back once the recording starts again. And we're back. So... Okay, so if we go back into system settings again and we go into internet and test connection hopefully this time it should work and there you go it looks like it's finding everything straight away and connection successful got nap type b which i need to look at but apart from that everything seems to be okay so just to make sure we go out of here and if I go back into the shop, which is what I was trying to do in the first place. And it's asking me for my password. So I'm not going to do that now because I know that works. And it all seems to be going in OK. And yeah, so it's all good. It's all working. So that's basically what happens if you come across this problem. What you need to do is you need to hold down the power button on the switch for around about 10 seconds. I think it was actually a little bit less for me. And then when it comes up with the power options, actually switch it off and then reboot it and it should work from there. So hopefully that will solve your problem. It was a bit of a pain for me. I spent about an hour fiddling around trying to work out what was going on and eventually that was the solution. So, yeah, hope that helps, and I'll speak to you in the next one. Bye.